Welcome fellow gold hunters. You got the game, you start it up, and you present it with this main screen. So what do we do here? You have single player, multiplayer, settings, roadmap, change log, and quit the game. You can see your current version here on the left. We have the Discord button where you can join the current active Discord for Gold Hunter. This is for the Gold Hunter MP Twitch account, where the developer actively works and you can follow along with his development. Let's go through all the menu items. Single player is where you can start your single player. A new game where you can load an existing save. With new game, you can start your money. You can pick 5,000 for a more challenging start or 25,000 for an easier start. Multiplayer, you can see the current active servers. You can create your own server. Pick your name, password if you want, and how many players you want. For the current alpha version, it's the maximum is 10. You can load a server if you have already got one. And then we're going to go through some settings. So yeah, in settings now. So a few things to note is with a new game or with some patch updates that comes through, the keys may be changed or worked on and they may not be the same as what you were previously used to. So it's a good idea to just go through them. A good thing to do is just to reset everything to default and then have a look at all your key key bindings. Items such as walking forward, backwards, you can see for movement. Just make sure that your keys are correctly set. Or vehicles, maybe your vehicle doesn't want to move forward or backwards. Come and see if the keys are set correct. So just go through all the settings and see if they all work. Graphics, you set it to what your computer can handle or what you prefer. Your audio settings, the way you want it. And then there's some gameplay options. Yeah, you can set also to preferences. Like if you want Imperial, you can change it here. Autosave is always a good thing, especially in the alpha. Uh, save and reload helps a lot of issues. So if you put autosave on, it will save every predefined set that you pick. Some people do not like the camera shake. You can disable it here. Your minimap, you don't want it to rotate. You want it to rotate this is where you can set it. Outlines is very helpful, especially in the beginning. You don't necessarily know where you need to click or attach items. You can change the color of the outlines. You can change the color of your crosshair. The roadmap, if you click here, it'll bring up the current roadmap. If you click on the change log, it will show the current change log for the specific patch version that you have. 